Hi guys, it's Chris with City Girl Homestead and Tom to Tom 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 the Bum. All right, it's Friar Tom today. <laughs> yeah. It's something. He'll be Friar to later on Friar today Tom. too. Anyway, so we had a little bit of hash browns left. I do have a whole nother package, but I didn't want to open that up. But remember when I made that? Um, what was it? Hash brown casserole? Yeah. That's what I had left in hash browns. So I thought, you know what? Let's get that out of the freezer and get that cooked up for breakfast. Now you're going to need to add salt and pepper, too. Did you wait till it fries a little bit for you? No. Go ahead and add it now. That way it gets right into the butter and everything else. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Now I'll put pepper on it. Go like this once with it. We usually do sheets in the morning, but our cat is so lazy this morning that we've decided to let him sleep for a little bit. <laughs> He's like literally <laughs> out cold. Yeah, he is. <sighs> so now, <clears throat> I have decided that we're going to do some pancakes. Tom said he wanted pancakes. So I had to come up with my own idea, too. Oh, see what she is. I know, right? I am like that, too. This is just plain pancake mix. Nothing fancy. No, I never measure. I know. If they get too watery, that's my fault. <laughs> you get the queen of soul, No. Yeah. No, that's your you job. You make it all running like that and goes all over the stove. That's not you. That's not me. Oh, no, no, no. I ain't buying into you that. You hear that? I'm not buying into that one. Yeah, <laughs> Poor Tom. I'm not buying into that one. Sorry. Poor Tom. He's right out of luck here. Now, I'm using this whole container because if we have any left, he can have it for breakfast. So whenever I open up a package like that, we'll use the whole thing because that way he's always got breakfast. He got a piece of potato on there. Oh. All right, so remember I bought those bacon crumbles, or sausage crumbles. There they are. We're going to have some sausage pancakes. This was my additional egg because he goes, yeah. well, we can have some sausage on the side too. And I'm like, why don't we just make some sausage pancakes. Then he gets what he wants and I get what I want, right? We should have turned this on a few minutes ago. Hold the oven? No. Hold the grill. Do you want to turn the oven on so we keep them warm or? No. It'll be fine. <coughs> It'll be fine. All right, so we're going to let that grill warm up. I should have turned it on already. And then we'll be right back. I'm loving this when we do stuff that he can do. <laughs> He's never made the pancakes. Whoa, I guess that got it hot. <laughs> Blame on. Blame on. <coughs> All right. <coughs> I'm going to make the pancakes. Guess you got to see some excitement on my channel today, didn't you? Just brush off the bottom. No, like this. When you dip, pull it up. Go just like that. Look at that. You can probably get three on there, maybe. Try not to let them touch. Look at you. I'd make him do my birthday breakfast, but um, he don't want to cook at 1.45 in the morning like that. I would do right there. Very good. I'm proud of you, Tom. Look at that. 
We only made a little bit of a mess. So now we're going to cook those just until you see some bubbles and they start popping. So he is going to flip his potatoes. I do have to do one part on it, so. See, they're getting brown, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to get this, and then we'll come back when we get through the batches here. So we actually finished this first batch, and we've decided that because there is going to be quite a few pancakes, I mean, we still got that left, and we got the second batch on there. We're going to, we oh, um, we warmed up the oven so that they can stay warm, and then whatever's left, he'll have for tomorrow for breakfast. And how's your potatoes coming, Tom? They're getting nice and brown. He has to wash the stove again because he got it all over. I, <laughs> I got to do it again. <laughs> I love this new stove, but this one is a lot harder to keep clean than the other one. A lot harder. It's the only thing I don't like about it. And eventually when he gets time, we are, we're not going to put two more shelves in there, just one. Because I agree with someone, if we get it too close to food, it might not, you know... Get too hot and yeah. get a little yeah. milky. Because we had the back of the stove on the other one, so we're only going to go down one more shelf. And then maybe I can at least get rid of some of them that I have on my counter or up in the cupboard. Or the ones that I use more. How's that? That works, too. Yep. So, we're going to get him on to getting more batches, and then I'll come back in the end and make eggs. Alright, so he's on the last bit of the pancakes. And I'm going to start eggs. <laughs> Maybe that membrane don't want to break. There we go. Your pancakes are more than ready to flip. Yeah. I was about to get up and do it. So we got quite a few pancakes out of that one package, I think. He's got some on our plates, and then we got some in the freezer, or in, in the it's oven. Like, oh, <laughs> All right. So I'm going to do up these eggs, and then we're going to meet you guys at the table. All right, so there's breakfast. Potatoes, eggs, and sausage pancakes. We think. Like I did a good job. <laughs> well, do they taste good with the sausage in them? Huh? They taste good with the sausage in them? Yeah. So we didn't go wrong by buying those bits? Mm -mm. What do you think, Jack? Have they good? And there's how much pancakes we still got. So they can eat away, and whatever's left, Tom will have for breakfast in the mornings. So you guys have a wonderful day. Be blessed, be a blessing, and goodbye, Tom. Goodbye, Tom. Bye, Jack. Bye. You guys have a great day. We'll see you at supper.